This is where you woke up? Quite a setup here. And perfectly fitting, if you ask me. <sighs> I guess Sonata Senpai! Fuka-san? She will be providing support to both sides equally. Is that acceptable? Wait! You can't just decide that for me! I won't help my friends hurt each other! But with your ability... Yamagishi, go with Igus. If you're wholly against the idea of us fighting, then you shouldn't be on our side. But, Sonata Senpai. Amana and I know what we want, and we're ready to fight for it. Igus son, have you decided what you'll do if you get the keys? I. I can't fight my friends. Takebo was right. We need to recognize our feelings. Sounds like you still don't. If you don't have anything to fight for, just hand over your key and walk away. But... No, I won't allow it. doing this show me what you've got I know you don't want to fight but we can't back down <sighs> this is really happening I guess I'll provide support it doesn't seem like we can talk them out of this this Sonata-san Amada-san What just... They paid the price for losing. They're still alive. They just won't return to normal until the true key is forged. But if the fires burn out, they won't come back. Even after forging the key. Is that why you brought us all here? So I couldn't stop fighting once I started? I, I have no choice. If you don't fight, they'll take your key. I can't let you die. Die? I guess... What does she mean? You tell us about something like that, right? I didn't think anyone else should know. Everyone is doing what they feel is best. For him, they don't need to worry about what might happen to me, too. I guess... No! This is why you... You have to... Anyway... I'm sure this is what I was meant to do. <laughs> um... Sister? Don't call me that. You're not my sister. Do you... Hate me now? <laughs> That doesn't matter. You're still more important to me than anything, so I won't stop. Even if you hate me for it, I will protect you, no matter what. get what's going on. That's 
What happens to the losers, huh? That's correct. And no one's taking my sister's key. No matter who we have to beat. That's what I expected from little sis, but... I guess... What about you? You wanna redo the past? Or move forward? <sighs> oh well. I didn't exactly make a choice myself. I've been thinking. The past or the present. I don't know. I feel like that's the wrong way to look at it. And maybe, maybe the problem's us for seeing it that way. I mean, just look at us, beating each other down because we can't agree. Do we really got what it takes to go back and make an even better future? What if we end up making a worse future instead? <laughs> look, I get that we don't got much time. If we rush this fighting each other, no question we're getting a worse future. So, this is my choice. And I'm standing by it all the way. We gotta fight anyway. And I'll just knock some sense into all of you. That's the best I got. <laughs> he was here. I bet he'd know what to do. <sighs> Junpei san. Sorry, I guess. You can't be the one moving on to the finals if you don't even know what you want to do. So, I gotta do it myself. No matter how tough it gets. <laughs> Thanks, Carmara. Alright, I'm ready. Let's get this show on the road. No hard feelings, Kay! So don't hold anything back! This is wrong. There has to be another way. Junpei-kun! Koro-chan! I thought... We were all searching for the same thing. I thought we all cared about each other. So why? The next battle will be the last. If we win, there won't be anyone left who can take your key. This can't be right. I think I agree with Junpei-san. That we're the problem. And knowing that I might die because of all this... It's terrifying. Terrifying to think that conflict is inevitable, because agreeing with anyone means disagreeing with someone else. So do we really have no choice but to hurt the ones we care about the most? That's just... I don't think I can take it. Sister. I can't do this. I won't. I'm not fighting anymore. I'll give you Kari-san and Mitsuru-san my key. And this will be over. No! You can't just let yourself die. I did. And that would be fine. Besides, you still don't know that for certain. I should be okay if my power core remains functional. Wait, hold on! I... I had a premonition. I get... That I haven't shared much about myself. But I wasn't trying to hide something. I just really don't know anything. I'm not sure when I discovered my emotions because I don't have any memories. I just woke up here alone. And I only knew two things. One was that I had a sister somewhere out there who would understand me. And the other was that if I didn't do something, she would die. At first, I thought it would be because of the abyss of time. But I don't think so anymore. Now I think, it's that power you awaken to. A power that leads to its wielder's death. Its wielder's death. The answer 
to life. I went to find you so I could save you. But I ended up causing your power to awaken. That's why I would do anything to protect you, even if it means you'll hate me for it. Because you're all I have. Metis. <sighs> I felt the same way about someone once, but that's exactly why I won't fight anymore. I can't hurt the people who made me who I am, even if you're right, and it ends up leading to my death. No! I don't want you to die! <sighs> why do you have to die? Why does it have to be you? Why can't it be me instead? Please don't leave me behind. I'll give my life for the key, too. And if that doesn't work, then I'm coming with you. So we can always be together. What exactly are you saying? Please don't leave me all alone. <laughs> <sighs> I'm sorry. Don't worry. I'm not going anywhere. I know how painful it is to be left behind like that. How could I do that to you? <laughs> you always seem to remind me of the things that are most important. I guess. Feelings for others can be painful, and even make us hurt each other. Honestly, it can cause a lot of suffering, but if I try to avoid that by not making a choice, I'd just be passing it off to someone else. I... I think I finally understand what Yukari-san was saying before. Now everyone needs to recognize their own feelings about who he was and what he meant to us. I was running away from how I feel. What will I choose if fixing or letting go of the past isn't the right way to think about it? Fuka-san, I want to discuss something with you. Hmm? You too, Metis. about what I said, didn't you? I can see it in your face. I did. I understand what you meant now. There are four lit flames. Then the victors of this battle will be awarded the true key. So, Agus, have you decided which choice you would make? I can't go back to the past yet, so I won't give up this key. I see. Then it appears we are in opposition. Yes. I won't give up on what's important to me. It may be painful, but I will stand by my choice. I understand now, thanks to her. Sister. You know, all of this may have actually been for the best. I've been acting so empty and mechanical lately. Like when we first met. I actually thought you were just gonna hand over your key because you didn't want to fight. But what you just said... It's like you're alive again. Which means we'll both be giving it our all, right? Yes. And I'm ready to prove it. I feel just as strongly about him as everyone else. Alright then. Guess we're done talking. 
And I'm not giving up on what's important to me, either. You better be ready, because I'll do whatever it takes to win. Like both sides give it their all. No holds barred. You can do it, I guess. I guess... Here. I know that you'll do what's best for everyone. So I'm with you all the way. This must be the true key. This may sound strange, given the circumstances, but I'm so glad you're all safe. <laughs> yeah, so... You really don't want to go back? What? Hey! I want him back. I want him back. I don't care about anything else. I just want him to come back. I tried. So hard to be strong and to look forward and just accept it all, but I can't. I can't do it. I just can't. <sighs> you curry, son. That's not. I made him a promise, too. I told him I'd do my best to change this world. People would stop wishing for the fall. That's why I wanted to move on from the past. Just focus on the future. Yukari-san. But that was just a promise to myself. Not to him. So it... It can't end like that. Yukari, it's hard. Unbearably hard. But if you don't face that pain, it will never heal. So what? If I face it, it'll suddenly be okay? I'll just accept that he's gone? Or forget all about it? That won't happen! All of us should know by now, that never happens! You face your pain because it'll never truly go away. Yukari, would you help me fulfill the promise I made to him? What? It was more a promise to myself, like yours. He taught me so much and showed me so many things that I've come to treasure. But before I could thank him, he was gone. The regret was suffocating. So I promised myself I would always be there for the ones I care about and fight to protect them no matter the cost. And you're someone I care about, Yukari. What? Me? You may not have thought much of it, but to me, last year, when you refused to give up on me and gave me something to fight for again, I will never forget that. So this time, I... We want to be here for you. Me too, Senpai. I... The pain of losing someone close to you is terrible. But you don't have to hold it in. And Yukari, you've kept yours locked up for too long. You've been trying so hard to push forward that you never stopped to grieve. 
It's all right. We're here for you. Your friends are here for you. <laughs> Yukari-san. I want him to come back too. But I stopped to think about everything like you told us to. And I realized something. So please, I'd like you to listen. I want to know what exactly he did in that moment he used his power. We still aren't entirely sure what really happened to him. I think we should know that before making a choice. So I won't use the key just yet. This is the answer I arrived at. After learning everyone else's feelings. <sighs> What really happened? I agree. We should know the whole story before acting. Sounds good to me. But, uh, can we even do that? I'm not sure. All the doors to the past are gone except the one to his room. There's actually one more, remember? We've been using it this whole time. That's right. The door to Polonia Mall. The doors reflect the minds of those who pass through. If we wish strongly enough to look into the past, that door should allow us to do so. I see. It would certainly be worth a try. Is something wrong? I was just thinking... I don't really have a reason to be here. And I... I did some horrible things to you all. So... I shouldn't go with you. Dude, what are you even talking about? We got ourselves into this mess. None of this is on you. Yeah, it's our own fault we got trapped here. And for squabbling with each other too. You're sticking with us, whether you like it or not. Don't you remember? I told you I won't leave you behind. Huh? Now that I think about it, it's pretty lucky there's still that one door left, huh? It almost seems too good to be a coincidence. Huh. Actually, that is unusual. If its purpose was to prepare everyone for battle, why is it still here? We have the true key, so the fighting should be over. But the door hasn't disappeared. So then... Does it have another purpose? I suppose it would make sense. If that door hasn't fulfilled its purpose of preparing us for combat, perhaps there's still an enemy for us to defeat. Our own feelings were the cause of this situation, and Aegis's proposal would take us to the source of that pain. I wouldn't be surprised to find something waiting for us there. <sighs> so, what should we do? Come up with another plan? If there is something there, that's even more reason for us to go. That's what I think. Then this should be our final battle. <laughs> that sounds familiar. Feels like January again. I wonder what is waiting for us. Another large shadow, maybe? No point thinking about it. We just gotta beat it, no matter what it is. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. And I'll support you all as best as I can. Okay, then. When we work together, there's nothing we can't do. Now let's go! <laughs> 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 